hi guys welcome back again to the channel so speed Darlington was seen complaining bitterly on how frustrated he has become ever since he moved back to nigeria he talked about his life in ghana how rosy it was probably he will be relocating soon he also talked about how cities is performing better than naira he talked about the poor electricity he talked about generally how frustrated he has become simply because he is a Nigerian. He talked about dividing Nigeria. Maybe is going to make everything better. People came for him in the comment section. They were like, everywhere is hard. Everywhere is crazy. But then I came across this post. Things are hard now and there is a high cost of living everywhere. And when you compare Ghana to other countries, Ghana is doing far better. Which he said that he totally agree. I'm going to allow you guys to watch the full video. Ghana, where we they make fun of 40 years ago, we they make bad for them. Ghana must go bad. Today, Ghana is better than Nigeria. To be very honest, with the way Nigerians are tripping into Ghana, I won't be shocked if we get Nigeria must go back, just like we had Ghana must go back back then in the years. He also shared a lot of things, which way Nigeria, what Nigerians should do to make Nigeria better, especially in this critical time, critical period. He talked about division of the country. And in case if you don't know, Nigerians have actually been fighting. The Igbos have actually been fighting for Biafra. They said they wanted Biafra more than they want anything. If we not get Biafra, there is nothing anybody is telling me about Nigeria. Nigeria can never get better. At this point, what we are talking about is what that will make Nigeria better. So according to Abe, he said, if there is nothing like division, he's an Igbo man, if they don't get Biafra, if the Igbos don't get Biafra, Nigeria will never, never be better. I go Ghana. Ghana, no, Ghana, I go not Ghana. Ghana, where we they make fun of 40 years ago, we they make bad for them. Ghana must go bad. Today, Ghana is better than Nigeria. I won't lie, Ghana has done so well for themselves. Even if there is nothing, you know, them having the ECG card that enables them to do a lot of things from the comfort of their home, then them having electricity, constant electricity, their cities coming up to an extent is, 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 is what emulating. So I'm, I totally agree with him. Like, Nigeria needs to do better. Five cities. Five Ghana money, five CDs is 500 Naira. What are you telling me? There is no future for Nigeria. The future of this country lies in the hands of Nigerians as, it's, as we speak right now because I don't think the government wants to hear. I don't think the government wants to listen. I don't think governments are doing enough for Nigerians to survive. So I think what we all need now is for Nigerians to wake up and do the right thing. The hardship is compounding. You give me light daytime where I don't need light. Night time when I need light so I can get a good night's sleep. You take the light so generator will just the destroy my whole piece. Having poor electricity in Nigeria is already what we are used to, okay? Like, the generator sounds is no longer weird. It's no longer awkward to our ears because literally we are used to it. Then we are used to it, okay? Like, we can stay one week without light and that is cool for an average nigerian some people ha have stayed three months four months five months without lights and they are cool okay so comparing ghana to nigeria this is not a comparison video but for you all to know what we need to do if then we had ghana must go back then and they did well they left and did well you know improved in their country i think we should also have nigeria must go back just maybe nigerians can go back to nigeria to improve our country so i'm going to read address you know, read some messages, some tests, some comments, how Nigerians reacted to this post. Even some Ghanaians also reacted to this post. So let's just take a few comments. So this person said, if you want Biafra, start by going back to your region to lay good example because Abbey is currently living in Lagos and he's from the eastern part of Lagos. You don't need to put laugh emoji while making this post because he's speaking the fact and I believe he's not trying to be funny here. He's not. No worry. If you they say you they stay for my area where life no day day for six weeks, you for understand. Whatever this man is saying right now is not funny so if you are trying to laugh over it please do not laugh because it sounds so so serious and this is crazy so this person said we don't just need lights just to sleep at night we need 24 7 lights i think it's not only mean light this light issue they pain ghana is far check Benin republic 10 million naira now is about 3 million cities nigeria no good though. tell them even Benin republic has light always not to talk of nigeria who claims to be the giant of Africa. So this person said, um, calm down, Abe. Ghana, where you they praise? Their citizens are suffering. Nothing to show for it all. The economy bad. Just calm down. Someone also went as far as saying that um, in Liberia, 
that they don't even see light at all that liberia is worse than nigeria which i'm shocked because i thought nigeria literally right now is the worst african country to live in because of what we are facing why are people laughing why the laugh em emoji does he sound like he's joking please this one no be everything person they joke with the time is very hard where the lagos they talk about biafra if you want if you are serious please go back to onicha make you start from there first things you need to take serious you guys are laughing in the comment section nigeria is going backwards wake up light no suppose they go so for me i felt he, what he's saying is actually true okay like right now nigeria is going through hard time if you are watching please if you are near based in liberia is it true that Liberians don't have have poor electricity just like Nigeria? Because these comments literally shocked me, okay? And also, if you're living in Ghana, how is it over there? How is your economy over there? Lastly, I would like to know in the comment section, do you think Nigeria will work better as a whole? Or do you think we need to get Biafra? Like the Igbo should be divided for this Niger for Nigeria to work. I would like to know your honest opinion in the comment section. I know a lot of people also want to know how ways to help nigeria to be better in the meantime if you're yet to subscribe to the channel click on the subscribe button for more news more educational videos more awareness on this space and i would like to see you guys in my next videos please be kind stay blessed and safe out there bye guys